This is the news from Cloud World Developer Edition. This week, friends, was full of exciting updates on innovative Oracle technology that's putting developers in the front seat. We started the week with a bang, hearing from Andy Mendelson on why he believes Oracle Database 23AI may be the most important Oracle Database release ever. We are trying to move our, our focus in the database organization as we move to this new world of cloud where Oracle's taking over the operations uh, of databases for you. Um, we're trying to make sure your developers, not just your operations people, but also your developers now have a really great experience uh, and are very productive working with the Oracle database. So we are solving some really fundamental issues that customers have had um, for years and years. We have this great technology called JSON Relational Duality Views that lets you essentially build object relational mapping right in the database for those uh, your developers who want to see data as JSON documents. Um, we've got this, uh, of course, property graph right in the database so your developers can, again, take standard relational schemas and put a graph view on it, a JSON view on it. And so we sort of unify all those worlds together. Andy's solution keynote paved the way to an exciting main stage keynote with Juan Loeza. Juan walked us through the all new AI centric developer innovations in Oracle Database 23AI. JSON relational duality is a very big deal. This is, I think, one of the biggest breakthroughs in, in, in um, data management years. I've been working on this thing for decades. And it sounds very simple, but the ability to map these things back and forth, and particularly the rights, is, is actually quite sophisticated. There's a new technology that we're introducing in 23i that's going to make developing these apps dramatically simpler, give developers a very simple access format, exactly what they want. We've added the ability to generate SQL from natural language with a, with a feature we call Select AI, so you, a developer can express in natural language what they want, and we'll, we'll use an LLM of your choice to generate the, the SQL, a first draft of the SQL that then you can edit. So all these technologies are really revolutionary technologies uh, that really are going to help accelerate um, the, our path to the future. And over here at Oracle TV, Jenny Sy Smith and I had just a little bit of fun talking with Kendall Fire and Fritz Nelson about the advantages of AI on Oracle Database, you guessed it, 23AI. So with AI, we want to bring AI to the data. Mm -hmm. So the whole idea is we need to help enterprises build AI apps on the Oracle Database. And these applications are not just using AI. Uh, Jenny mentioned all of the innovations, the ability to do the queries with JSON or unstructured data, with graph data, find relations in the database, all of that is, is possible. I mean, it's a game changer. So Jenny, if we could pick three areas then to pay attention to when it comes to AI in this release, what would you suggest? All right, we'll start with something we call algorithmic AI, which okay. is basically machine learning. And we've had that in the database for 20 years, over, right? over yeah, maybe two decades. Yeah. And the idea is that if you're training your data models, why not bring the machine learning algorithms into the database where the data already resides, right? So that's one. Um, AI vector search, definitely, and Kay mentioned it, right? AI vector search is a way for us to basically allow customers to do similarity search to augment their generative AI so that it produces more accurate information. And then the third piece is Select AI, which we introduced with Autonomous Database last year, and now we're going to make it available in Oracle Database 23 AI. And Select AI lets you talk to your database, so you don't have to write SQL code. So guys, it was a fun and busy week here in Las Vegas. Now, if you missed any of the action, tune in to Cloud World On Air to catch up. See you guys next year. <laughs>